everyone this is Mary Ann and in this video I would like to show you how my setup is doing I've already made a video about how I have set up my Franklin Covey with 1.75 inch rings but a few people have been asking me how the dividers are doing how the tabs are doing and how the envelopes are wearing and I also made a new today marker because the file of hacks one broke and so I wanted to show it to you guys so it's pretty much the same setup still over here I have the things that I have to file away and here I have the fountain pen that I use for signing checks and the Coletto pen which has black green and pink and the pencil it, but I'm not gonna be using this anymore as soon as the as soon as the ink is all used up I'm going to rinse this out and put it in storage because I'm gonna be using a different fountain pen for that now I have two sheets of PVC fly leaves just to protect the cover page and this is the cover page it has these are all my sections and this, these sections are my mobile sections that I take out and put in the Sofiano whenever I have to go somewhere that, that um, does not require me to bring the whole thing. But that hardly ever happens. <laughs> so this is the cover page still and this is the section for my university. The prayer section is still there. The to deal with section is still here. Capture section is still here. This one carries all my cards and photographs. They're still the same. And then I have my mm, cash envelopes. And this is what I wanted to show you guys. This envelope gets moved around a lot several times a day because I keep my cash in here and sometimes I even keep actual coins in here and they don't fall off and it's I've had this since I've had this since the day that I showed you the setup the first time so it's been a while I think it was in September or October I think it was October that I showed this to you guys and it's wearing very well. It gets crumpled here because that's where I open it and it got smudged here for some reason but there are no tears at all except for here, a teeny tiny one which is being kept in check by the cello tape. As for the hole punching, it doesn't look very stressed see the holes are still pretty much in a circle shape so that's working out well this one carries my lottery tickets as you can see the difference um, this is more worn than this because this one gets accessed several times a day this one gets accessed like once a week so the envelopes are doing fine and these are my daily pages by the way the dividers are not doing very well because this is not cardstock this is just paper that I found and I did not put whole reinforcers on these so look at them they're all deformed and if I keep it this way it's gonna tear someday soon However, compared with the divider in which I used whole reinforcers, the holes are still in very good shape. As for the tabs themselves, some of them are already getting dirty and um, folded. And but that's okay as long as I can read them and as long as they don't fall off I'm still okay with that now in my daily pages as I have already made a video I'm using the hyperdex 
this is my color key and look at my full page today marker <laughs> Um, my my Filofax frosted ruler broke. It came free with a Safiano, but because I take it out a lot and keep moving them and use it as a ruler several times a day when I'm on the move, it broke. So I made this, which is more sturdy. It came off a cover of some other album and then I made it just the same width as the Filofax pages but taller on the top and on the bottom because if I have this entire thing closed and I need to access the page for the day I just do that and I'm right on page it's not like this one and uh, my, my daily pages are actually in the middle of everything so it gets heavy when you turn it so I, I need the entire thing to be supported by the weight of the today marker and it works because it, it doesn't cover anything so if I'm shading something here I can still read it here there is no need to remove this because I can only write on one page at any given moment I cannot write on two pages at the same time so that's okay if I'm writing down here I can still see this if I'm writing down here I can still see this and then reminders you know how I do this and then over here I still have the monthly pages and then I have my journal pages and then I have my medication calendar and then I have a section for my son financial projects I have creative projects life projects section for Etsy shipments Etsy expenses Etsy ideas Etsy orders a section for updating my blog and ideas for my YouTube channel, notes for my ghost novel, writing ideas and prompts, and the directory for my day job. And at the back here, I have blank checks, bank slips that are blank, and extra hyperdex circles because see how easy that was to turn because if I make a mistake on the hyperdex I cannot correct it because I use the Stabler tripless fine liners not the friction erasable pens because I like I like how it looks so if I make a mistake I just very carefully peel this off and replace it with a new one and that's why I have extra hyperdex circles on here but the drawback is that because of the extra circles that I have pasted onto my two pages per day it it's gotten more bulky and I cannot close it at all I mean look at that that's how fat everything is there I cannot even close it it's not it's not very easy to carry but that's okay I have a big bag I always carry a big bag so carrying this around is not a problem and considering that it has everything I need I have pretty much decided to make do with this so there that's it this is how my setup is wearing at the moment and um, I hope you were able to get some ideas from this video I especially like this this 
uh, the full page today marker because even from here, even when the binder is completely closed, I can just do that. And I can also do that from the bottom because I can feel it. It's the only protruding thing from the edges of the binder. So, yeah. so that is my setup for now. No changes from the last time, but just to show you an idea of how everything is wearing and how everything is working. So that's it. Until next time, thank you for watching. Bye!